Soil Conditioning 2010, a Society and Environment Active Citizenship Project by Jolene Martin, a primary education student, and Avid Gardner, and Roberta Bowman, a primary to secondary education student and laboratory technician. Humus is the undecomposed remnants of organic matter in soil. It has unique nutrient and water holding properties. A healthy soil has good amounts of humus and has a high presence of the precursor, general organic matter. Chemical fertilisers and overuse destroy this balance and lower the productiveness of the soil. By caring for soil health with cost-effective permaculture prim principles, we can develop a more sustainable and productive future. Through our research, we gathered information and evidence to plan and create a cost-effective soil improvement program. Our location is the ECU Bunbury's campus in the Environmental Studies area. Our plan is to increase the humus in the soil by adding readily available organic matter. Our resourcing is the lawn clippings, including the rupu and leaves from the university grounds. We contacted Bunbury Malatastas and they were happy to show us what was involved in developing a good, sustainable soil conditioner. We discovered that composting is not an exact science and just about anything organic can be added to the soil to build up the humus. Things such as ordinary garden waste, lawn clippings, wood shavings and treated bio waste are all materials that when composted or rotted down create wonderful organic matter which in turn makes humus. When changing or improving soil, always take some simple baseline tests. By comparing the base tests with future ones, the level or amount of improvement can be measured. The tests that we recommend are pH, moisture content, drainage and texture. These tests require simple equipment and can be performed with general household utensils. We tested the proposed ECU garden site and from the results we recommend that adequate organic matter is added to the soil before planting. Drip or underground reticulation is installed to aid in water delivery and to avoid potential problems through runoff. Testing is continued for ongoing planning and improvement strategies. Throughout the project we had our own little lawn clipping compost pile to see how well it composted and how long it would take. It was very simple. We just mowed the lawn, put it in a pile, wet it a bit and covered it with a tarp, turning it over once or twice a week. During the course of five weeks, the trial clippings have turned from green to yellow and finally black, ready to introduce to the existing soil. Throughout this active citizen project, our vision remained firm in that with very little effort, you can increase the organic content in your soil through the use of composted local lawn clippings, which will increase the humus ratio and ultimately the overall health of the soil.